Hi, this is Matt Sweeting, this is Bob Sweeting, and this is Monterey Race Week 2001. Hi, Bob Sweeting here at uh, Concorso Italiano in Monterey, California, 2012 edition. We're here checking out the uh, Panteras. The Panteras have always had a problem with the brakes because the vacuum boosts are so small, and most Panteras have a radical cam, uh, wild induction, and just no vacuum. And this booster is actually uh, a smaller version of the GM style vacuum booster. So there's never enough vacuum to work this thing. The booster's too small. And this has had a conversion adapter plate to take the Italian master cylinder off and put an American master cylinder on. So that's a nice, reliable upgrade. But again, the brakes are weak. And these cars have always had a problem with weak brakes. They keep trying to put on Brembo's and all kinds of exotic rotors. And the whole issue is low vacuum to the booster. Valentino Balboni, who was the chief engineer of Lamborghini, came to us because the Lamborghinis have issues with vacuum. So we have a Hydroboost setup that will fit this car. As long as we get a power steering pump on the engine, we can run a hydro boost into here and the stopping power is incredible. Stopping power will match the acceleration of the car. Uh, almost all the Panteras came with an Italian master cylinder that had some really weak donut type seals in them. They're actually loose fitting on the piston and uh, they're not available new. So. Most of these guys have gotten this uh, adapter to convert it to an American master cylinder which has V-shaped seals and much more reliable sealing. So that's a nice upgrade, but the vacuum booster is still the weakest link in this whole car. The Panteras were built with a 351 Cleveland Ford engine. And they were pretty potent uh, engines to begin with, they were 400 horsepower. but. Almost all the Pantera guys put in a larger cam, a bigger carburation, some have fuel injection. All of those issues make more horsepower but also decrease the vacuum. Again, this is our problem. So a lot of the Pantera owners try to band-aid the weak vacuum, the vacuum pump, electric vacuum pump. And uh, those things are very slow working, they won't keep up in traffic. And again, the original factory booster was was too small to begin with. So even if they did have vacuum, the car has very marginal stopping power. So that's why we recommend the Hydro Boost for these cars. This Pantera has been modified. We don't know how many cubic inches it has, but it's all aluminum block, aluminum heads, headers, and fuel injection that looks like Weber carburetors, but it's an electronic fuel injection. So this is a huge performance upgrade and he has no vacuum. This car has a vacuum pump to run the brake booster. And he knows it's weak and uh, he's got to consider going to hydro boost on this car. Wind it up.